Hello everyone, this is Cypher Deck, and today we're back in Osiris New Dawn. I'm on my way back to that um, cave, that's where I set up my base, but I'm running into a new structure. I went out to get some items um, to um, start building and came across this structure, and so we'll go ahead and check it out together. Um, one thing I didn't do is I didn't bring food or water, very bad idea, also didn't bring my main, um, rifle, because I can't use the super rifles yet, and uh, so we have, we have this, <laughs> uh, is there, okay, there is a door, okay, so this looks like it's just a little station, maybe? Not seeing anything in here. Okay. So that's nothing. That didn't pan out to be anything. I guess you could build in here if you wanted to. You could make this like an in-between with those. Um, if you go into here, um, put the printer in here, the chemistry station, that kind of thing. But uh, yeah, other than that... <laughs> Also, I got points. Let's see what kind of points. I got engineering points. And I got two science points. So let's go ahead and put those in. Um, wait a minute. Didn't I put these points in last time? No, no. I put the points in civil. And I uh, went with greenhouse construction. There. What do I need to do? Okay. Let's go back out here real quick before I put points in. I want to figure out how to make this. So need ability chemistry. So let's um, go back into here. Skill web chemistry. Chemistry. Okay. And this will be battery technology. First aid. Okay. Unlocks the ability to build a habitat. Furniture and gather uh, water and cook food. Okay, so uh, while those aren't very important, um, those are things that we need. This will be the uh, this will be the next one we end up getting as far as sciences go. Engineering, though, on the other hand, uh, do we will we need defense walls and how are they against the the little crawly guys? What was that? I, did you guys see it? Well, hopefully you'll pause the video and see what that is because I didn't, I didn't catch it. So I could do explosive traps if I went with the defensive walls. But I kind of want to continue up. And that sucks. I could have kind of got that. So I need to go this route. Uh, lab construction. <sighs> Ooh, we're getting there. Um, but I want to go ahead and go with ground vehicles next. That way I can travel a whole lot faster to get to the places that I'm going. Because it, it is far. Uh, I think it was... I, was, I started at like 600 meters away. So six or 700 meters away from, uh, from where I found the actual resources to the point that I am now. So that isn't good. It's a pretty far away to even find any resources. And the resource that I did find, luckily, was copper, gold, titanium. Uh, those, and I ended up having to drop the plutonium. So that means I got to go into that cave again. Also, uh, I forgot in that video, the, the last video, that I did not go to the right. I only went to the left where we ended up finding uh, Queen Cleo. I didn't go to the other side. Um, so that is the plan. We're going to go ahead and build some things, get something started. I should be able to, once I make the forge, start um, having the ability to get um, this done. Because steel is made with iron i believe in aluminum and glass is made with sand all you have to do is make a shovel and you'll you can get um you can get the sand to make the glass that that also allows you to make glass jars which allows you to um, harvest sap things along those lines really wish that had stuff in it I wish it panned out oh hello and here we are 
All right, can we can we use this yet? Still 14 minutes. I think it's just because. Uh, let me go ahead and save real quick. Make sure there isn't any codexes that I need to learn or or whatever it is. All right, let's check in here. All right, <laughs> don't don't freeze on me. Let's go ahead and drop all this in here real quick. Sort it out because hopefully my robot has been going back and forth and getting stuff for me. Um, so let's see. I need to go ahead and get some food, um, get water, go ahead and get all of the metals. Got copper, I think, aluminum. Did I get everything? Yes. All right. Oh, geez. It's, not, it's dark out. So let's go ahead and go into here. We're going to go ahead and make a forge. <sighs> We're not going to make a forge because <laughs> we got to go get plutonium. Yay. Quick, Chloe. I'm not going to fight you today. I'm not going to fight you today, Miss Chloe. You don't kill me. Okay, so hopefully, if you remember, before we went into the area where uh, Queen Chloe... Oh, come on. Don't make the sound again. <sighs> okay, so it's always going to give me that, I guess. I'll take it. <laughs> I mean, does that mean I get refreshed stuff, too? That would be kind of weird if they refreshed it. Let's go back over here. Apparently, assault rifle, take all. That's kind of odd that they do that. And then we can press that again. See that that's going to fail. Turn on the light. Get some medication abilities. There we go. I think I actually need, nope. The suit health is, uh, is fine. I just need to get some hydration in me. Probably should have ate first. Okay, we're good. That's a lot of food I had to eat. I've been I've been gone for a while though, so I could I could see how that would have taking a lot of food to, to get done. Um, <clears throat> let's see. Yeah, that doesn't really do anything for us. So, um, okay, good, good, good. I'm not, I'm not going very deep in this time. I'm not even going to check the right uh, tunnel yet because I really just want to start getting some building stuff done. And then next time um, or later on, we'll go check it out. There we go. <clears throat> okay, let's go ahead and head back out and I'll meet you there. Okay, so apparently it's day three already, and uh, the sun is back out. Maybe whenever you go into a place like that, it... Uh, are you stuck up there, guy? Is that my robot? Are you my robot? Okay, I'm, I'm going to leave you alone as long as you're going back to where I told you to go. Are you bringing stuff back? Okay, he's, I'm not messing with him. He, he knows what he's doing. Or not. <laughs> Either way. Uh, Alright, so let's go ahead and get aluminum, copper. Oh, that was gold. Copper. Um, iron. Really don't have much iron, to be honest. Magnesium. Where's my titanium? Titanium. Wait a minute, I had titanium, did I not? Sort. Aluminum. 
So is it right in front of me? Do you guys see it? Titanium. All right. So the first thing we need to build is we need to build this. And we're going to go ahead and turn it around. Can it come forward? Okay, it can't. So we'll put it there. Nice. All right. So now that we have the forge, what we want to do is I want to go ahead and see plates are going to be magnesium. Um, so we'll put magnesium, aluminum, and iron in there. We'll go ahead. Oh, so every time it crafts, it's going to craft two. So we'll go ahead and craft. I don't know. Craft until we have about 20 of the iron. There we go. That gave us 22 pieces of steel. There we go. Now we need to use one piece of steel and four aluminum to create a shovel. Okay, got it. Now you'll see that some of this stuff is blanked out because of the fact that, um, like this, it was the first time crafting it. Uh, if we had glass right now, it, this would still be grayed out, but you'd have to, um, so you'd have to create it for the first time. Wait a minute. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Okay, so you can break the, oh, there it is, there it is. So I need to figure out, can I make leather? And leather right here so i have stuff okay good 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 let's get some of the stuff that we have um let's get that this is meat though shell get all this stuff get it all get get it all give me the crab eye all right so we're gonna go in here now we're gonna go down can i okay leather do i not have any of these items okay so i need um so it has to say hide that sucks so we didn't get any gnat hide so that means i'm gonna have to go fight gnats um good thing is they're right next to us uh but we can go ahead and make meat we'll go ahead and make as much of that as we can Because this is going to fill us up a whole lot more than anything else. Okay. So that's it for that. Alright. So for this, I still need to get hide. Uh, but this right here is the reason that I wanted to go the melee route. Edge blade made for cutting and ripping. <laughs> Craft time 5 seconds. Damage is 22 plus or minus 2 uh, with a 5% critical hit. Um, so definitely want to try that out. Um, definitely need to make beacons uh, if I plan to travel anywhere at all. Uh, also, if you make things, you need to remember that they're in here. So we're going to take this glass container. And we're going to we'll, we'll leave it in our inventory because we'll, we'll grab sap with that. We'll need it for once we get our first um, lab set up, or get our lab set up, brother. All right, so now then, we're gonna go ahead and bring out the shovel. We're just gonna shovel. Can we not shovel? Can we? Not? Okay, I was about to say, can we not shovel sand? All right. So while, while since we're gonna be doing that, let's go ahead and go into third person mode. There we go. Hey, buddy. Um, let's get your shovel out. Yeah. So you'll see there is a glitch in the graphic that it'll only go once, but you can just hold it down and, uh, it will, as long as you're pointing down, it will go ahead and harvest it. Oh, look at all the sparklies. 
So I'm almost over encumbered. <laughs> I don't want that to happen because if you become over encumbered, um, then you won't be able to, uh, <laughs> you won't be able to move. Yeah. So let's see here. We'll get this done. All of this made here. Get that in our inventory. Um, I'm going to go ahead and just leave this stuff uh, in here for right now. That way I don't have to worry about carrying it with me. Definitely take the meat. And we'll eat some of that. Was it meat? No, we need water. All right. So we have that. We can make beacons now. Um... Assault rifle. Uh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. S heavy assault rounds. Heavy assault rounds. T. Wait a minute. Did that thing even have a name on it? it? I thought it was just heavy assault rifle. Here's our assault rifle. Heavy rifle. Yeah. See, it doesn't actually have a, a specific name for it. Anyway, what do I have to do to make those? Because it's something I would really like to start making. And this requires heavy assault. How do you make heavy assault? Okay, does it actually have assault in here as an item that you can make? Okay, here's a assault rifle. Um, and then you go into assault. What? Tungsten. Diamond? Heavy Assault Magazine? So you have to have the magazine, then you have to make the rounds for it. <laughs> okay, so it's not going to be as easy. So melee was probably a better idea to go anyway. Um, even though it really sucks to fight those guys. Um, uh, but they tend to get pretty close pretty fast. So we'll, we'll worry about it as that happens. But Okay, so we got... We got this, we got this, that's what we need for this. All right. So, do I want to make it here? This place really isn't a flat place for me. I mean, I could build it down there because you have um, a pretty good space, but really don't want it to be next to this base. Um, really just want this to be an outpost for being able to use the mine. And honestly, Mr. Mr. Blayblurp, or whatever we call him, uh, is not a very smart robot. So we probably need to put this in a valley somewhere where he can actually get to and say, Hey, mine those resources. Hmm. I'm going to go back this way. Just... Oh, wait, whoa, whoa, whoa. Um, I need to stop running. Okay. So temperature. Cumbered. Yep. Won't be encumbered very much longer. But, uh... Yeah, we want to we wanna get into a flat area. Because I'd like to make extensions going off of the backpack. Um, or off of the, um, off of the base. So that it's all one big unit. The only thing that you can't have as one big unit. Let's see here. Structures. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. That's something that I want to make. Uh, I got the gold. I got the ability to make the wire. Uh, other than the fact that I haven't found a single rubber tree yet. Whenever I make this and put uh, this in there. Oh, guess what? I need to be able to make plastic. How am I supposed to do that? I got to make the chemistry set, I guess. Chemistry set, what do I need? I need rubber. 
<laughs> the world chem station. No, no, no. Okay, wait. Whoa, whoa. Okay, I can make that. I can make that. I can make that. Let's do. Let's go back. Let's make the chem station first, and then we'll worry about everything else. Yeah, I um, I didn't know about the the fact that I can make the chem station by just putting a little bit of metal in a a little bit of metal and um, some some glass together. If I knew that, then everything would be different. So also <laughs> in this in this um, not so great world that I, I'm living in. I, I don't have any kind of, um, I don't have any kind of gas or any natural fuels around me. Is that, is that this? Okay. <laughs> I don't have any fuel. I don't have any gas. I don't have hydrogen, oxygen, any of that around me that I've seen so I'm gonna have to figure out I gotta find these locations I need to make beacons so that I can go around and get this stuff done because this is going to be a hindrance if, if we can't get that taken care of we can't find the resources that we need to be able to make the stuff that we that we need then really we're uh, we're stuck um, where we are right now all right, so let's go ahead and go to here real quick. And we'll go ahead. I really wish we could just say make all <laughs> because I really hate just hold my finger here. Um, huh. Yeah, this is fun. <laughs> but we will we will need a lot of glass anyway, so it's it's all for good. There we go get the glass and we'll go ahead and make the chemistry station now um, utilities okay there we go and really that wasn't very much um, that wasn't very much steel required for that so let's Requires perfectly on power source. Yeah, of course you do. <laughs> uh, uh, how? How? Not enough materials. How do I get materials? Okay, what do you need? Need to build a solar technology. I need carbon wire. Don't know how to make wire yet. Uh, printer. I just need rubber. All right, so I'm gonna go ahead and just uh, start looking for things, guys. I do, I without a rubber tree, I don't know how else to do all this stuff. But I will go on a search and find it, and I will be right back. Okay, so I'm back. I've been looking forever for some kind of rubber tree or oasis or anything that would allow me to find a way to do whatever it is that I'm doing. Now, you can see there's that building that I found before, but I ended up coming around this way because I was uh, hoping that beyond these rocks, maybe there would be green and maybe that's what um, produces the the fungus plants but i'm seeing a solar station over here with a dish and all kinds of things and hopefully that will actually be a thing this time instead of just a um a cool looking um background so here's a lot of ore as well i think this is actually where I was, uh, this is all copper, gold, slash, um, titanium, which is amazing, good stuff here, but, uh, yeah, I didn't see that before, and this has to be the hill I was on, 
So either way, I'm I'm working on uh, moving. Did, is my robot companion still with me? <laughs> I had him follow me, uh, but he probably got lost. So I'm gonna go check this out. You still have yet to see a single rubber tree. Um, haven't seen any of the um, the hydrogen or oxygen. Uh, really, guy? Just gonna pop up right there. <laughs> Okay, all right, so we have a guy there, um, but yeah, I, I see all the banana trees, see all the bushes and everything, just not seeing a single fungus tree, and um, yeah, so let's go ahead and check out what this thing is over here, I'm, I'm not even messed with that crab. Um, I don't know if he drops hide though, so I probably should check that. Um, this isn't looking promising though. This is not looking promising. This is the, actually, you know what this reminds me of? This reminds me of a place that was in, um, was in the old map but it looks different I think there was like five of those solar stations before um, is there anything here I can even manipulate touch do anything with um, no does not look like it oh am I stuck now am I stuck <laughs> okay so these are just visuals again nothing i can actually do with anything with okay that looks familiar but i don't know if that's what i think it is and there's a little crawly crawl right there i'll just shoot that way and just hope it will skitter off okay what are you just iron take it I'm gonna go through iron pretty fast all right so it's pretty cool the shadows that are coming off of this but um I guess I'm still looking um for some kind of way to get started oh hi i hear you oh i hear i see you now Boom. See, I don't think he's actually going to have leather or hide. Yeah, I'm telling. All right. Well, I'm on the I'm on the hunt, guys. I'm I'm working on it. I'll be back. Well, I guess if you travel far enough into the desert, <laughs> you'll find everything that you need. Uh, though I still have yet to find carbon, diamond, uh, azurite. Um, and everything else. I, I still haven't found the trees, but I found this. Um, I don't know. Will from far away, will it tell me what it is? Nope. So I have no clue what kind of gas this is because the colors are changed the, from what I'm used to. I don't remember there being a white. Um, gas um, and I don't have the proper container to find out um, what I think I'm going to do <laughs> is I'm going to have to put some kind of waypoint here some kind of thing 
Uh, what what all can I find right now on my? So I can find personal assistant, which is twenty one hundred meters away. Inflatable, which is two thousand meters away. It's palm position. So pretty much that's the only thing I can find are those three things. Uh, uh -huh, uh -huh, uh -huh. Okay. Um, wait a minute. Is that a thing? Holy crap. That's just a snub, but that freaked me out. Oh, and there's more of them. Hey, Snub. Hey, Snub. Hey, Snubs. There's two. There's three now. Oh, we got to deal with this. Gotta deal with this thing. <laughs> oh yeah you can die oh my goodness can I go even go down there I can but I mean there's I, they just spawn right here okay well I'm done with that done with the snubs yes I am Okay, snubs, you, you be, you be you. Uh, okay, is that a thing? I don't know. Uh, anyway, uh, still, still working on it, guys. All right. <laughs> so I'm heading back. Um, still haven't found what I'm looking for. But for those of you who remember the last series that I did on this. You know exactly what that is up there. And I don't like it. I like it some because it means that carbon is probably close by. Or something that is really important is close by. But it means a whole bunch of things. I don't know where it's going to come from. I don't know if it's if it's in this section or if it's over there or if it's over there but that means bad things that is a skeleton if you don't remember and it is um, a beast that is it's like a sandworm oh no oh no so I now know where I am um, as far as where I was on the old map. Now, does that mean that this is now going to get familiar to me? Probably not, because this... Okay, wait a minute. If this is where I think it is. Up there is where I used to have my base, which means we have resources that should be in this area that I can use. But that said, we still have this situation right here that we got to deal with. And is it just going to come up from right underneath me? I, I don't know. But um, I know that if I die, I'm going to lose all my resources. And I'm not happy about that. And, um, also, where is the actual crater? Um... And can I kill this thing? <laughs> Alright, let's go ahead and reload our gun. It's becoming daylight. And it looks a whole lot bigger than it did before that skeleton. So, this is going to be interesting. If 
for sure because this looks like a crater here. Uh, I remember being pretty okay. It's an adult right there, and also an adult crab, but I've been fighting those the whole um, way here. So I don't know if anything is going to actually happen, but figured figured I'd uh, let this play out and see. Yeah, that thing is absolutely massive compared to what it used to look like. And if it's that big, now is it going to be that big again? <laughs> Wow, uh, they did a lot more detail to the um, skeleton as well. But usually skeletons like this mean that there are big rewards close by. So I'm going to live with it and see how it works out. And um, we're still going in the direction of our home, so uh, I'm not really worried about it too much yet. Yeah, you can see there's there's the main mouth right there. Oh. Yeah, this is where it is. It should pop out right about there. If I remember correctly. Oh, and we're about, we're going to have one of these sandstorms right now. Wait a minute. I thought I heard it. Can't tell. Once you hear it, you gotta move though. Oh. Hey, really wish this would go away. Let me let me go ahead and skip ahead till it's over. Okay, so it is now clear. Let's go ahead and start heading down here. Maybe it won't attack me. That'd be kind of nice. And normally in these craters, you would find like carbon or something. I'm not finding it. Actually, I'm not seeing any resources. I see a red blob right there. But that doesn't look like a resource to me. It looks like a plant, maybe. Um, huh. Like the lava or something. Alright, well. Not seeing anything, but I guess I'll continue on, guys. <laughs> um, this is what looks familiar to me, so I'm going to go ahead and check the places that... Uh, or check to see if the places that I remember are here. If they are, that'd be... Amazing. Okay. <laughs> I'll be back. Well, it would seem that humans have been here. Uh huh. I wonder if I can build on that or if that's just a destroyed base. Um, just looking around here because this is kind of where you would probably find rare resources unless you. Had broken textures, <laughs> but um, this this looks like um, a pretty cool little place. Can you build on it? Let's see here. 
Nope. But this is what it looks like uh, bare bones. So this would have been there, uh, the place where you would have your food, your things like that. This is your barracks right here. And um, right up here is where your actual crafting of vehicles would be. Why there, why there are these things in the game, I don't understand it. Because of the fact that um, there is nothing that they're giving you here. It's pretty much useless. You can see here. Oh, wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. No, that's nothing. Got got excited there for a second. Now, is this all messed up also? I'm guessing because of the fact that it's in the open air. Looks like it has faces in it. <laughs> um. Hmm. Yeah, I don't understand. I don't understand why they give us the these kind of things other than the fact that they're trying to show that there have been people here before and then don't actually give us the ability to build on it uh, or anything along those lines. You can see there was a dish up there as well, but really there's no point in going and checking that because it is not going to render anything useful, it would seem. Um... All right, well, I am on my way home, ish. Well, guys, it only took a long time, but we finally found the rubber trees. Oh my goodness. <laughs> oh my. Wow, it, uh, I thought I heard water, it's kind of weird, because it's not, um, it's, there are things that need to still be fixed in the game, uh, that seems to be an issue, but here is the rubber tree, oh my, <laughs> it took forever to get here, so, here we go. Or get, get rubber. Uh, this is still considered mining for some reason, but yeah, rubber. <laughs> Getting the rubber trees. Um, are they falling around us, or are we picking them all up? Hopefully, we're picking them all up. Um, I am encumbered, it would seem. Um, though it looks like it can carry a lot of it. Okay. Um, I want to drop the bark. Bark is something I can get pretty easy. And I'll go ahead and just get a little bit more of this. Try to get two stacks. Wow. Okay. Well, there's an adult up there. Kind of want to keep traveling, but... Wow. Wow. It, you know, uh, that took me probably about two hours worth of walking just to find this because of fighting, stopping, looking at things, and hi, young crabby crab friend, 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 no! <laughs> but I found some good places along the way that I'd like to actually set up my base. So, uh, what I'm going to have to do is get to a point where I can go ahead and, um, there we go. Oh, never mind, we got another one. One second. Let me, let me reload. Got it. Got it. Okay, there you go. <laughs> Thank you for standing there and dying for me. You're a patriot. <laughs> okay, um, so I'm gonna head back home and we'll get to building things and such. 
Okay guys, we are back finally at home. I went ahead and just uh, laid out where I'm going to put this for right now. Um, we have no space for pretty much anything. But I wanted to go ahead and test something uh, between this video and the next video. Where I put something in the storage that really doesn't matter to me. And if it is there whenever we come back into the game, we know that we can use the storage which will help us a whole lot. So here is where the hard part begins. So this wasn't very hard. This was pretty easy to put together. Um, actually, uh, that's four plates right there that we got to take care of. So we're going to come into here and you'll see that, uh, oh, it's six. Is it six plates? Can't really tell because it's dark. Oh, yeah, it is six plates. So what we got to do is we got to go to our... Uh, repair gun and then we're gonna come up to here oh my goodness uh, it's a whole lot more than I thought it. okay there we go and we'll go ahead and do the left mouse button press F so this is the easy part these building this little section right here this is the easy part the inside part is not the easy part it's going to take a whole lot more to do and um let's see is that just a lot okay so that's all done that's so much easier so much easier than uh everything um than everything else so i i was hoping i wouldn't have to put these slots on right here that i only had to put these three okay this yeah so this is going to be the project because we need to get this this all built so i was able to get um i was able to get rubber so i can make um more things now the problem is is that i now need to find carbon so that i can go ahead and um and make a lot of other things that i can't make right now like solar panels for power i don't know if you need power for the habitat but uh, let's go ahead and open that. I don't know why it's doing the depressurization. But I don't know if I'm going to have enough for all of these. Uh, okay, so as long as uh, aluminum is something I can get easy, iron is something I can get easy. If I want to have a window, does that. Oh, it only takes one iron, two aluminum, uh, and one copper. If I want glass, I just add glass. Um, what is... That's a coupler. Don't know where I want the coupler. And we can always take it down. So I think I'm going to do some windows. I know I need to do walls. Uh, but we'll make sure to worry about that. Uh, oh, yeah. See, there's a nice window right there. There's just a lot of it that we have to do. So I'm going to do walls the rest of the way around. That way we can serve resources. And I see something wants to attack us. Hey buddy, you okay down there? Okay, well, alright. But uh, yeah, I think what we'll do is we'll go ahead and end it here. Um, I'll just keep working on this. And um, next time we'll find carbon. And maybe diamond and maybe lithium because those are also things that we need to find if we ever want to make a vehicle. Uh, we also need to make circuits. We got so much stuff we want we we want to get done. But uh, yeah, this is um, this is becoming a thing finally. Um, <laughs> it totally took the whole time trying to find the stuff. But uh, it was pretty cool. We did find the rubber trees. It was like an oasis where one massive rubber tree was uh, grown. And uh, it looks like I am going to probably run out of aluminum before this thing is done. So I'm going to have to go out. Actually, I may have to... I ha oh! Uh, before we go, let's test it out. This is the new weapon. This is the dragon tooth. Come on, buddy! Let's do this. Let's let's wrestle. <laughs> Come on. I know you want to attack me. I know you. Oh, yeah. Let's get him. Get him. Oh, yeah. 
<laughs> there we go. So that is, um, let's go ahead and get an outside view of the dragon tooth. That's, that's the dragon tooth right there. So anyway, guys, hopefully you enjoyed. This is Cypher Deck. Peace out.